Yo, what is up guys? It's your boy Zach. I am so sorry. This um, video was supposed to come out uh, two or three days ago, but I was waiting for uh, some information that you guys might find spicy. I got extra info that is not in the patch notes. I, I will convey it to you guys later in the video, but let's go through the patch notes quickly and highlight some of the important things. So we're gonna skim through it and I'm gonna give you like a top 10 things to look forward to. All right, guys, without further ado, let's get right into the video. All right, here the uh, patch note says a uh, Farlight 84 is uh, scheduled uh, for release on the iOS app. Um, if you guys go ahead and open the uh, app, you can see that you can uh, pre-register and it'll come out on the 24th or 25th. So keep that in mind. This is the official global release. I know they said that the uh, Android was global release, but now it's officially going to come to iOS and Android as well. Uh, keep keep in mind that Steam will most likely follow right after. They do have a open test on the 25th as well for Steam. They uh, the brand new Onyx Party uh, Battle Pass will uh, launch uh, on that day as well on the 24th, um, guys. I know you guys noticed the time here it's around what is this three to four months but don't worry it's not this long actually uh you'll know uh, you'll find out a little bit down the line that it is actually uh, sectioned every uh it, it it is sectioned out for every month so month one month two month three etc uh so you I, I believe you will be getting different rewards every month I don't, I'm not sure exactly how they plan to do this, but I guess we'll find out on the 25th because everything is locked in the in the test server right now. Uh, matching uh, for cash cups, uh, limited return of the sign in. Okay, so now sign in events are a thing. So every time you sign in, you get a reward. Limited return of operation Firefly. Free SSR skins. Yeah, so the more you play, the more I think six games, and then you can get a. Um, a free roll on the uh, lottery. It, it's it's completely for free. Uh, the Isle the Isle City giveaway. Invite your friends to the Isle Tower to game diamonds. You are skin and duck side. All right, that's fantastic. Games celebrate exclusive event of Lilith tenth anniversary celebration. Our fireworks come like play mission. The event celebration. All new lottery, lottery chest. Uh, so, so many lotteries, guys. They literally have one. Look at this one. Sorry, one, <laughs> two, three. Oh my god, three different lotteries. And I heard there's a fourth coming as well that they didn't announce here yet. Okay, so that's a little bit behind. You guys are gonna have so many skins, so many lotteries to go through because they're giving, they're bringing things from the past, from the betas, and new stuff. And they're just pushing it all at once because they're backed up with um, with uh, content and events that they need to put it now in this new season that's coming out uh, because they have a lot of new things working for the coming seasons. So that's why they're putting everything here now, like the old and the new together. So if you didn't have a chance to get it before, you can now. Pack system is now available. Now open free packs by complete. Oh, this is the free pack one that I was talking about. So you play six games and then you get uh, one pack opening. New mode, the new mode game a solo. So this is not a solo BR. It's one versus one. I do explain it in this video if you guys want to go ahead and check it out. A new vehicle, Rocket Tarantula. I have not yet tried this vehicle, but I've seen some gameplay and it looks nutty. Absolutely nutty. This is what I'm talking about. New season, guys. S season 7 uh, ladder is here. So the new season will, uh, opens when uh, V14.3 is updated. So season 1 duration is C, one month, guys. It is uh, the 24th of April till the 24th of May. And then the, tw uh, the 25th of May until the uh, 24th of uh, June. And then the 25th of June till the 25th of July. So I think uh, SR capsule, SR hero skin, and uh, avatar. Yeah, so this I think that's what they're talking about here with the season. That's why it's per month. Um, it, it definitely could be linked to the battle pass. We'll we'll see on the 25th. 
uh, optimization system new features so we cannot check their match okay so remember what you had to uh if you queue you can't check anything now you can so even if you queue and you're waiting with your friends and no one not a problem go ahead and open any tab you want so i have luxury weapons new uh voice effects for heroes uh new added uh hero mastery system increase your amount this is really beautiful i love what they did with the mastery system I just wish they would add rewards instead of backstory or backstory and rewards. But for now, you're just going to get the backstory of and lores of new heroes uh, of the existing heroes. Sorry. Uh, feature optimization. Uh, optimize or play for a few. Cause, OK, that's nice. Um, they do nearly added two languages, Japanese and Korean. Fantastic. Uh, warehouse UI. Optimize UI for game hero selection. Beautiful. Uh, battle adjustment. Battle mechanic breathing will no longer restore HP. So remember before if you guys like just crouched and waited for a bit your HP will restore. That, that is no longer there because they have reworked the shield system and the health system completely. If you guys want to check that out, that's the video up there. I have it uploaded. Mm -mm -mm. Here you see the newly added shield upgrade. You can now level up shield when sufficient shield is XP. Uh, newly added growth XP. Battle town. Revival. Revive mechanics. The mechanics for team revive has been adjusted. Survivors can now be revived on the spot. Their uh, required uh, time for revive has been increased. Okay. Default HP of heroes has been reduced. So keep that in mind uh basic hero hp has been adjusted the value of each bar of shield has been reduced the ammo capacity of smg i know you guys loved and wanted an smg buff there you go and the solar rifle inventory has been increased so that's perfect heroes a lot of you guys need to go through this if you have a favorite hero go through this take your time and read your favorite hero what they what buffs and nerfs they uh, added to him a uh, game mode, a battle when you add a supply ship to send airdrops. So now you can see this supply very visibly in the air and you can track it and follow it on the map. Uh, airdrop has been adjusted. Airdrop no longer contains MG7. Okay, so they took the MG7 out of it. Contain hair. Okay, just with adjusting. Not only switch followers during the cruise phase. Okay, nice. Uh, Deathmatch. Uh, da, 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 da. the muzzle mod for bar 90 ha have been removed in deathmatch okay smg damage is now more sustained and it can deal more damage from a distance actually this is not just for team deathmatch this is also for br don't know what they didn't mention up there uh the melee aim assist for the smg has been enhanced okay i think what they mean here the melee itself has an aim assist now so actually you can use melee in the weapon now because it will kind of track your enemies a little bit not too much it wasn't too much but it's a little bit of course ads has been added um guys the feature for the joystick to increase it will be there on the 25th i made sure i literally made sure that it's there on the 25th uh, I, I put it as a high priority to adjust your uh, move your joystick your movement stick on the left side so you can uh, make it bigger or smaller. Okay, so EMP bomb. Uh, the hover bike is uh, added. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, all right. So another insider information. The solo mode will have a rename soon. It's going to be versus or one versus one. Because solo has nothing to do with that 1v1. It was meant for the solo and duo modes that were coming out. But they got shifted to a later date because they're still working on them. Uh, but solo and duo is coming, I guarantee that. Not too far away too. So you can see it a month out or like a few... Uh, yeah, maybe a month out uh, into the new season. Uh, and on the 25th, uh, Steam will have a launch. I think it's the next beta phase, but it's going to be an open beta. So everyone can use it on Steam on PC. Um, I have contacted my good friend the Wolfman D on Twitter and I asked him to break down some of the key features that have been added on the in the patch notes. He is very meticulous and thorough with his um, analysis and breakdown. So I'm gonna keep uh, these screenshots. Uh, please make sure you read them all and go through it. So yeah, shout out to Wolfman if you guys want to follow him on Twitter. Guys, if you have enjoyed this video so far, please uh, don't forget to hit that like and the sub button. I'll see your beautiful faces in the next video.